Modal verbs. Lesson four. Going from intermediate level, advancing a little bit more. Let's talk about modal verbs, no solo possibilities, but hay dos cosas, habilidades también. Let's check it out together. Let's remember. Hi, how are you? Hello again, Colombia. Motor verbs convey. You know possibility may and might. Here's another possibility modal verb, but también habilidades. It's un combo, two things, ability and possibility. Let's remember, can is the present, could is the past. Could has various meanings. In this context, can, present, could, past. It can happen. The possibility exists that it can happen. Not sure, but it can happen. It could happen later. Those are possibilities. Can and could. Possibilities. Now you have abilities también. Can and could is habilidades. I can surf. The ability right now. I can surf. I love to surf. Casa Surf, Puerto Colombia. What's up? Listen to me. I could surf when I was eight years old in Miami. I lived in Miami. That's ability from the past, ability from the present. Modal verbs. Can and could. Two things. Ability and possibility. Anything could happen in life. You must be prepared. Modal verbs, base verb, always. Can't, couldn't, negativo. Let's remember our negatives always. Can't and couldn't. I can't, I couldn't. Negatives. Modal verbs, very important. Convey possibilities, and in this case, abilities. Modal verbs work in the present. They work in the past. They're for grammar, present and past. And there are more modal verbs. We got to continue the fight. I must. Let's go. Can, could. I can talk. I can't dance salsa. Se puede imaginar. Michael can't dance salsa. I don't have that ability. Tú puedes enseñarme. Porque yo tengo dos piernas izquierdas. Puedes enseñarme cómo bailar. I can't dance salsa. I can dance trance electronica. I'm a gringo. I can dance up here. Down here, I can't dance. Can you teach me? Help! 